and I have maybe here to, to open another paragraph because we are working very much in three very important notions in refugee camps, which is private, public, and common. And in the refugee camps, all these notions are layered together. So we are looking at, at all this and understanding in which way we could a bit challenge this right of return. And in which way, first of all, the first step I would speak about is that first how to combine culture of exile with the right of return. This is the first thing. And then I have, I should move to the next step, is that so far refugees were all the time represented as numbers. No, as, as, uh, and, and it's if you would look at all the ways that it was represented, is that numbers and to which place they belong to, and, and it's all about statistics, about number, about private property that was lost in the uh, in the 48 no and and as if the only way to represent people rights is through private property but then the question is that what is the if we would look at this right what would be the if we will look at it this way what would be the public sphere of this right of return how the mediterranean would be part of the loss of the right of return because so far Refugees are representing, and this is again very important within the world of art, because if you would look at, for example, the last Berlin Biennale, they took one, the biggest key of one of the uh, camps, and they put it in Berlin Biennale. And, and this, for me, was quite a problematic. Why I think it's problematic? Because from the first time you take the key out of the camp, as again, you... Uh, what, what, you, what, what you are doing conceptually there is that you again uh, detach the exile from the right of return. And as if what you are asking for is to return back home without looking at 60 years of exile, which is very important. We cannot take the key outside of the camp because this means that the camp is not represented in the whole image of the right of return. And if we separate these two things, it is for me very problematic in terms of art because where we are, should we stick to 60 years of representation in the same way, which is only the key and the private property, or should we go on? What is the role of art in this? And this is what was my argument as a Palestinian artist asking, should, are we really sticking into this idea of representing the right of return only as a private loss or the right of return is much bigger than this. First of all, taking it out of the camp is a problem. But on the other hand, where are, for example, we are all, we lost the Mediterranean, no? I, am, I consider myself a Mediterranean lady, a Mediterranean uh, person, and I have no access to the Mediterranean. And this is for me the main loss of the right of return. And it's not there, it's not there in the representation. The only thing that we are representing is the key, which is the private property. But where is the public property? Where are the cities that we lost? Where are the Mediterranean? That Where, where is all this out of our imaginary? In which way we could look at this and understand how to represent the public? And again here, if you would look at the camp, we all the time uh, uh, are a kind of the private and the public is not there because the houses that where the refugees do live do not belong to them. So there is no notion called private. And in the same time, the public in our mind is all the time related to the state, no? And the problem is that the state do not operate on these, uh, do not administrate the camp, even, either, uh, even the UN do not administrate the camp. So the camp is a place that is in the mind of the world, it's not, it cannot be considered public and cannot be considered private. It's, it's something, it's a third thing that we call the common, no? It's, it's a place that is totally self-organized by the people. They are the ones organized, they are. So how we could look at all this and represent it and not really to be satisfied only about the representation that was there since 60 years, in which way we are now working with refugees. We built this project called Campus in Camps, which is a university in the camp, where we are building a total dictionary together with 15 young lady and men in the camp. We are building the dictionary of the exile. Now, what does it mean for us 
uh, normalization of the camp. What does it mean private? What does it mean public? What does it mean common? How to represent differently the right of return? What is the key representing now for that? What is the camp today? In which way we could represent the camp and we are building a whole dictionary because we believe that what is happening in the camp is way forward than what the art is able what the art and architecture and academia is able to see there is a lot of things going on in the camp that has no names no names and no no way that it would it could be represented and so we are totally engaged together with refugees because this is the only way where art could be effective together with refugees trying to understand how to build a new dictionary where all the words that we are used to have, sustainability, normalization, improvement, could be looked at through the eyes of the camp. How the camp is looking at this, and, and we write it, we do it, and we, init, we begin to practice it and give names to what we could see. So, to, and, and what we can see that if we will look at these places, this is for us a way in order to give answers to a lot of crises that are happening in all over the world. No, we, we, there, is, there is crisis happening and we think that by looking at the whole practices of refugees, it is a way, and because the refugee by default is the figure that put in, in total crisis the, the state itself. No, it is the figure that counterpart the state. So how we could look, not really to understand how to resolve the problem from inside, but to look at the refugee as a way in order to figure out many, uh, many uh, possibilities and ways to look at the world in a different way.